Hello YouTube, how is everyone doing? It's Professional here. Welcome to the first part of Watch Dogs Legion Bloodline. Now, I had promised you guys this. I was really excited to play this. Aiden Pierce is back. We get to play as Aiden Pierce. I will be doing the Ballad of Gay Tony also, you know, alongside this. I'm going to be doing two playthroughs at once. But, you know, this is where we're going to start, you know, Bloodlines. It just came out today. If you're unfamiliar with Bloodlines, this is the long-awaited, you know, story expansion on Watch Dogs Legion. And you get to play as Aiden Pierce. Aiden Pierce from the very first game. I did a playthrough of Watch Dogs 1, you know, um, back in October. I'll have that linked, you know, at the end if you guys want to check that out. But this is my Aiden Pierce costume. As you guys know, I dress up as the characters for the games. So, um, let's do this. I'm really excited to see Aiden back. I think they got the same voice actor. Wrench is also in this and um, Aiden's nephew, so this should be a really fun story. I don't know how long this is, so I don't know how many parts this is going to be in, but it's obviously not going to be in one part. So I hope you guys enjoy this. Let's start this off. Let's start this off. Let's see what Aiden's story is like. Okay, let's see. New game. And I think that this... We're going to do hard. And I think this takes place... Um, this takes place, um, I think, a few months before the main story in Watch Dogs Legion. Zero Day bombings have plunged London into a state of martial law. The first incarnation of DedSec London has been destroyed. The second is yet to rise, and 4,000 miles away in Chicago. No, Aiden's still in Chicago. He still has that same car. Man, that's... Jordy. Phones burnt, make it quick. Uh, I'm like your one friend, Aiden. You should be nicer to me. Great. I'm hanging up now. It's a job, jackass. Fix your gig. I can't take it. Travel restrictions. I told you I'm not doing that hired gun work anymore. Oh, come on. It's corporate espionage. Scumbags screwing scumbags. No bystanders. Huge payday. Mm-hmm. What's the catch? It's in London, which is not the easiest place to get to these days. London. It's where Jackson lives. Yeah. Why do you think I called you, asshole? Okay, I gotta go. So, Jordy is still his friend, and it's kind of funny considering that Jordy tried to have him kill at the end of the first game. This is, I think, I think I'm going to enjoy this more than the main story in Watch Dogs Legion. I wonder what Aiden's abilities are going to be in this game. Really curious for that. To help you blend in, <laughs> everyone here must wear one now. <laughs> uh, your car fell through. The London bombings, uh, they change everything. Many things are hard to get now. That won't be a problem. Oui. Good, but it is also your flat. You have somewhere else you can go, family? It's complicated. <laughs> Uh, it is okay. Still family, no? You will see. Yeah. I will see. So Jack's, um, uh, Aiden's nephew lives in London, but this is like 15 years later, and he was just a kid in, uh, Watch Dogs 1, so I'm curious what he looks like in, uh, now. Thank you for accepting fixer contract 1138424. Two. 
investigate merger between Broken Tech Corporation and Rampart Automated Defense Systems SA. Hereafter, Rampart SA. Context. Rempart SA is a French private security firm specializing in robotic forces. Last April, they made overtures to acquire London's Brokatech, which specializes in advanced AI systems. But negotiations have stalled. Thomas Rempart, CEO of Rempart SA, sabotaged the deal after Brokatech spun off its Deep Labs division into a new corporate entity. But even without the Deep Labs, shareholders of both companies stand to make millions. So why is Thomas Rempart doing this? Objective. Rempart's delay is illegal under French law. Infiltrate the Deep Labs and discover what Thomas Rempart is willing to risk lawsuits over. Recover documentation and physical samples to support. ROE. Discretion recommended. Get in, get the evidence, get out. Pretty okay. tame as fixer contracts go. So this guy's lab, the fixer contracts, basically like contracts for hitmen, but you know, he's not, um, uh, you know, taking a hit here. He's, um, uh, you know, just infiltrating the place and stealing something. Um, but you know, I never thought I'd say this, especially to Ubisoft, but thank you Ubisoft for bringing, bringing back Aiden Pierce, and thank you Ubisoft for actually doing a single player story. You know, Rockstar could learn from this, you know, how many people have requested single player stories, but they, so many developers, oh, it's just online everything. I would even pay for a Modern Warfare, you know, story expansion. I'd like to see Captain Price and Gaz and everyone again, but unfortunately no, all they do is only... focus on Warzone. Why would they leave the lab unguarded? Okay, um... What is Aiden's abilities? Focus, aim weapon, aim after a, a weapon takedown to slow time. Gunslinger, press reload button while reloading for a damage buff. Shut down all nearby cars, drones, weapons, and security. Hmm. And baton, of course, Aiden's baton. Oh! oh. He's still got his baton. Okay. Still got his mask on. Well, I guess we'll use our mask then too. Might be a way to unlock that door in there. I really like how they kept Aiden's original personality as well. <laughs> they didn't try to change him up. team found out that Rempart is mostly interested in a piece of technology being developed by our Deep Labs division. Something called the Broker Bridge. The whole acquisition is just a ploy to get it. So Rampart's after something called the Broker Bridge. The whole acquisition attempt was just his way to get in. I should keep going. That door might be unlocked now. What was that? Hands down! Ah, great. Ooh. What's with the knocked out security guard here? Okay. What could this be? Client only wants some photos. Ah, oh, great. Damn, Aiden's baton does so much damage. Okay, that definitely helped. Photograph the labs. Um. None of this is legal. Not that it matters. Client wants the fruit. They don't care if the tree's poison. I like how they let you walk with the camera, too. Not a lot of games let you do that. You're completely still when you have a camera out. Stand down. Stand down. Wow. 
what happened here? I don't like the sound of that. Should keep moving. I hope Aiden has his default jacket because this isn't his original jacket. What is this? Electric burns, random though. Some kind of taser weapon, but not a gun. I'm definitely not the only one here. Uh. Fortunately, our surveillance team found out that Rempart is mostly interested in a piece of technology being developed by our... One of our contractors cracked one of Rampart's marketing PCs on a hunch, and they hit the jackpot. Rampart has sold a million units of something called the MK2 to the UK government. That's a presser mark too, by the way. <laughs> no, I'm joking. The selling feature is that it used human pilots connected to the machine by a direct brain machine interface, but he doesn't have the technology to produce it himself. He needs to broke a bridge, or he'll be in breach with the bloody fed to the tune of about a billion pounds. At the risk of sounding crude, you've got him by the bollocks. Okay. Rampart's Mark II robots don't work without this broker bridge, and he's already sold a million units. So, he needs the gadget or he's screwed. If I can get my hands on a prototype, then I'm done here. Locked. Should see if there's a closed circuit box around here. If I hack it or take it out, it should let me through. One of our lads hacked his email and found this. Looks like every part of his company is stolen or inherited. Can you believe this? Tosser would be living in a ditch if he wasn't born rich. Just want to let you know personally that we handled that crazy little man for you. The one whose bipedal robot design we recently acquired. He took down the blog post that accused you of stealing it as soon as we reminded him of his NDA. I took the liberty of canceling his media interviews for him. Wow. Looks like Thomas Rampart never had an original idea in his life. Even stole his billion dollar robot design from some basement inventor. Intruder alert! Intruder! This is going south fast. Need to get evidence and get out. Hello, Miss Larson. It's Director Aziz from Security. I've sent you my full report, but here's the gist. Rempart has been quietly acquiring Brokertech stock for nearly six months, so it's safe to say he's after us. Fortunately, our surveillance team found out that Rempart is mostly interested. Isn't that the guy who betrays you in the single player? Okay. I mean, in the regular campaign. Smart. Brokertech's corporate spies cloned Rempart's webcam feed. What's the most recent recording? Reload timing. All firearms are more effective in Aiden's experienced hands. After a reload, press triangle at the correct time to trigger Gunslinger. If completed successfully, receive a damage buff on the current weapon for 15 seconds. Oh, that's cool. Okay. Let's make things interesting. Got them. I saw something here. Yes, 
you. I understand. You're saying that Brokatech will agree to a merger as long as I step down as CEO. That's right, but right now... Well, the terms. I think favorable? So I'm fucked. If I don't step down, I don't get the broker bridge and I'm jailed for fraud. And if I do, they, they probably throw me under the bus anyways. And then all this Thomas, is a waste of time. Stop talking. Toma, I've been trying to tell you. We believe our networks have been penetrated. They're probably watching right now. Shit. Shit. Okay. So this other intruder can either cause remote equipment malfunctions, but they're invisible. So that's Thomas Rempart. Man-child with a private army. Dangerous combination. Broker Bridge Chamber unsealed. Please ensure your identification is visible at all times. Broker Bridge Chamber. Sounds like that's where I need to go. This must be where they make this Broker Bridge. Might as well get some photos of this, too. Get a photo of that. I'll do it. Now I just gotta grab this thing and get out of here. Then I guess I ought to look up Jax. Wait, what am I supposed to do right now? Oh, in here. Give me that. This, uh, mm, three. I need it for a thing. Two. Okay, I guess we're doing this. Oh. <sighs> you never think that you'd see these two guys fighting. Uh, what the hell? He's from Watch Dogs 2. Man, you are spry for an old guy. Just drop the device and you can go. No, I told you I need it. This isn't personal. Just stop. You stop! Not gonna happen! Why do you want this thing so bad? It's just a job. A job? Just slack off for a day like a normal person. Just slack off for a day. Okay, um... Okay, I need the ID quickly, um... Okay. You're starting to get on my nerves! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> yeah, I get that a lot. Aiden is by no means, you know, a joker like, you know, you'd have other characters in other games. He has a very serious attitude to him, and that's what I like about him a lot. Nice try, pal, but you're out of runway. Open the door. Uh, no thanks. You're from that dead set group in San Francisco, aren't you? You mean the one that busted you out of a cage guarded by sweaty Eastern European gangsters? I seem to remember that was mostly your friend. But now you're alone. This isn't a dead sec op, is it? Yeah, well, I grew out of dead sec ops a long time ago. Okay, we got it now. Uh, open. Oh. This game has a much stronger opening than the than the regular campaign. That he said you were that guy that we saved from a jail. That was an Easter egg in Watch Dogs 2. Oh. 
that's not good. My people dug this out of your chest. If it was one inch in any other direction, we wouldn't be talking. I read the files you downloaded from Brokatech. The ones about me. They're all technically true, yeah, but... I feel like they didn't quite give you the full story. This is the Mark I. Simple AI, good for simple things. Uh, the Mark II will be controlled by the thoughts of a human pilot. Military, police, it'll all be transformed overnight. But one day, these will permanently hold the human mind. No more death, no more limitations. We'll be able to live on Mars like it was Maui. And for all this, all I need is that little device stolen by your partner. The one in the stupid mask? I don't know that guy. <laughs> Silence was a better strategy than lying there, Mr. Pierce. Oh. Are you done? Look, I don't know that guy. I can find him. I'm good at that. You just have to let me go. I just don't think I can trust you without some kind of insurance. Perhaps your nephew, Jackson? Hmm? He lives in London, doesn't he? No, no, don't tell me Jackson gets kidnapped. Good deal. Take it. <laughs> yeah, look, I, I want to believe you. I really do. <laughs> but I just can't. Not yet. I'll return once my little helper here has made you a bit more trustworthy. Hmm? Oh, looks like he's tasing him with his hand. Get out of here. If you're still listening, wait. Look, I've been here before. I know how this goes. If I go after you, you go after Jax. And even if I win, then your people go after my people. And on and on. Live and streaming. On and on. And I don't have much of that left in me. That's not good. Better get him out of there. I don't know, Wrench. But I can help you find him. <sighs> You're obviously new at this. You still think torture works. Don't be stupid, Redford. Let me help you. Overheat? Okay. So we're playing as Wrench right now? Okay. Hack. The scanning aid didn't give me anything. Something tells me that was a good part. I get my stuff and get out of here. Locate your gear without being detected. We don't have any stuff right now, too, which is. Shit. 
robots. Definitely not equipped to fight them. This is one of the new enemies. Now you got robots that you can that yet you got to deal with. I won't get far without my gear. Better find it. Drone designed for recon and material recovery. Might come in handy. Oh, thank the fake baby Jesus, it worked. So, uh, you didn't mean all that about hunting me down and stuff, right? Very cool. Not even close. You almost killed me. It was a stun bomb. How does one teeny little stun bomb almost kill Aiden fucking Pierce? Piece of that little stun bomb wound up lodged in my chest. Oh, yeah, I know that's not what that's supposed to do. Uh, look, I gotta go, but try to remember that I was the one who saved you from the torture bot, okay? That's worth something, right? Wait, where are you? <laughs> nice try. What is this? Uh, pick up. Hello, executive's office. Hi, this is Francine Vance with the GBB. I was hoping to speak with Mr. Rempard, please. What is this concerning? Is Mr. Rempard in? I ask again, what is this concerning? I was hoping to get a comment on a story about certain meetings between Mr. Rempard and the Prime Minister at the PM Summer Residence. I will direct your message to Mr. Rempard. Thank you. Uh, did Mr. Rempard and the Prime Minister make any arrangements prior to the construction of the latest RADS facility? Thank you. Goodbye. Disable that, okay. Okay, so I was dumb. Um, uh, Aiden had the spider Let's drone the entire work. time. Um, I was looking around for it, and then I realized that he had it um, swap between air and ground by pressing R1. Oh, so this thing can fly? Okay. Uh, okay, here we go. Wow, that's a pretty useful drone that Aiden has there. Okay. Neutralize the robot guard. Okay. Oh, Aiden's missing his hat. You can't, you can't, can't do it when his hat is missing. Okay, wait. We'll wait till he gets near that. Shoot at rampart to, to overheat them are more effective than lethal weapons. Once shooting a robot's battery on their pack, okay. Okay, 
get ready for this. Man, these these robots are tough. Um That's it for that. Okay. Okay, so now we gotta escape. Locked. Maybe I can use the drone to find the terminal and unlock it. This definitely makes Aiden really useful for um, hacking stuff now. Okay, let's move. Let's get out of here. Well, I don't like this. Right, let's do this. There's intel here. Um. Creepy smile. Okay. <laughs> so Wrench makes memes. Um. <laughs> Let's get all of these um uh, collectibles here before we leave. Recording? Right. Continuing the deposition of Mr. Thomas Rampart in the case of Russian Central Bank versus Rampart Automated Defense Systems. I presume you are ready to continue, Mr. Rampart. Actually, and I want this on the record, I just got off the phone with your colleagues in Moscow, and we have reached an understanding. This deposition is no longer necessary. I... You should have told me before we resumed, and no one has contacted me. They will. I can assure you. Come with me, Mr. Rampart. But I... Hey, it was nice to meet you, Mr. Lobakov. My secretary can show you out. Have a safe flight, okay? Okay, bye-bye. The Red King of Revox. Now here you see it takes all the running you can do to keep in the same place. The Red Queen through the looking glasses. Some humanoid robots with machine guns guarding government buildings and oil pipelines might not prestige an optimistic future, but the Thomas Rampart, CEO of Ram Rampart, automated defense systems. They're a necessary step along the road to utopia. The sad reality is that it's very hard to convince investors to fund a project that just improves the welfare of people in general, says Rampart. You have to convince them it'll also make money. That's why I do private security. My end goal has always been the advancement of the human species. Rampart character Characterizes his personal philosophy as a combination of transhumanism and the Red Queen hypothesis. Essentially, he believes the, that between climate change and resource scarcity, the evolutionary pressures being faced by humanity will require our species to fully integrate technology in order to survive. Our dreams have always been hammed by our physical limitations, he says. I believe that one day we will do all the things we dreamed of, but first we will have to evolve into something that today we would not recognize, something that might even scare us. Of course, Rampart isn't the only big tech CEO thinking this way. Most famously, London based billionaire Sky Larson is rumored to be developing. Singularity adjacent project herself. Sky Larson is a genius, yes, but he's also she's also a perfectionist. Rampart smirk. A technology arms race is a race. It matters who gets here first. Okay, we got everything. Let's get out of here. Um And if I remember, there's actually a way to get out of this place through the rooftops. If this is the same place that I'm thinking of. Um No, it looks like there's not. This is a different location that I was thinking of. move then oh my god why was that guy there okay not good okay 
Okay, Aiden Pierce can cause like a blackout, basically. That's cool. Something he would do. Um, Well then. All right. How does this thing work? Uh, Bagley? Call Jackson Pierce. No public listing for Jackson Pierce can be found on the Bloom Network. Pull it from my encrypted files. Voice, print, ID, Lena, and drop a pin at his address. Done. Calling him now. I'm sorry, the Bloom Mobile customer you've tried to reach is unavailable, and their voicemail box is full. Please try again later. Looks like I'm doing this in person. Okay, so, um, I guess we'll probably, we will probably leave it off here on Aiden hasn't discovered all of London yet, um, uh, so we'll, um, we'll probably leave it, leave it off here, guys. Hello, Aiden. Do you mind if I call you that? I'm pretty disappointed, I gotta say. I thought I could trust you, but... You can't trace this device. I made sure of that. Yes, I'm aware. I'm much more concerned with finding the broker bridge. Where is the wrench? Like I said, I don't know. But I'll find him. You'll get your gadget. Uh, even if you did tell me, I couldn't believe you now. Looks like I'll have to pick up your nephew, Jackson. We can swap. You won't find him. He's smart. Smarter than me. <laughs> uh, I've crushed way, way smarter people than you, bud. Okay, so I guess we'll wrap it up here, guys. I hope that you guys are enjoying this, because I really do enjoy this um, this uh, story and this DLC. I'm going to have a lot of fun with this. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys on the next one. Take care, everyone.